Thank you, Joe, and uh, thank you for inviting me to come here today. And it's a, a real honor to be presenting our film. Uh, back in 2007, uh, co-founder Margaret Tobolowska, who was a cellist in the National Arts Centre Orchestra until very recently, and my husband Gary McMillan and I founded the Leading Note Foundation. Uh, the store is called The Leading Note, and we called the foundation after the store. Uh, the actual program is called the Orchestra Program. And back in, uh, actually it was in 2006, you'll see in, in the film, so I won't ruin the film, but I heard about a program uh, called El Sistema in Venezuela uh, that now uh, teaches and, and adopts hundreds of thousands of children to play music every day after school. And it's not a music program. It's a social program through music whereby when you put an instrument in the hands of a child, you can imagine how it can change their reality. And the philosophy behind the program is about playing music together because you're not going into a little room now. Obviously you have to practice and, and do that at home, but the actual hands-on program is playing music together, where you're making harmony together, you're listening to each other, you're respecting each other, you're being compassionate, you're being patient. And those are all the, the values that are behind uh, our program, the Orchestra program. Uh, this film was made in 2009, when we had only been going just over, a, well, we've been going two years at that point. At this point now we have about 200 children, and uh, back then we had about 80 children. Amongst our children uh, are mostly new Canadians and children from low income uh, backgrounds. And we really encourage uh, those, that demographic to, to take part in our program because, as most of you know, learning a musical instrument is a very expensive pastime. You have to buy the instrument, buy the music, and pay for weekly lessons and, and all the other expenses that go along with it. And it can be quite a lonely pastime too. So we wanted to create a social program through music whereby we open the opportunity for children who would never otherwise have the opportunity to come together as a community and make music together. And it has been a journey. It's been an amazing journey where children from who were born in refugee camps to brand new Canadians just having arrived in Canada to people who have been here for generations all coming together. We have, you'll see in the film, um, we've said over 24 languages spoken amongst our children. We haven't counted recently but I would say it's well over 30 languages spoken amongst our children. We have a violin program in York Street School and I counted the number of languages spoken amongst 16 children and I think there were 14 languages amongst 16 children. So it's, it's quite remarkable and of course we're coming together with it speaking the universal language of music. It sounds like such a cliche but it's so true and it raises the the level of understanding and friendship, not just amongst the children, but amongst their families too, because the families are coming in and dropping them off, and everybody's coming <coughs> together and chatting, and this is the commonality. It breaks down barriers, and it enriches the community. So much so that um, our, our key uh, tagline is orchestra, and you can't see under the t-shirt, but it says, Empowering kids, building community. Again, nothing to do with music, but of course the name Orchestra is very much to do with music. And to find, uh, just to finish off the introduction, because it's not in the film, uh, because the film is it's reasonably old, even though it has actually just been officially released. But we've sort of changed the, the program around a little bit where we've got Orchestra is the main program. And under the orchestra umbrella, we have kid players, and they're the children who play all the orchestral instruments. Kid singers, which is a choir, our choir program. We have four choirs. And then the third program is called Kidly Winks, which we just started uh, two years ago, 
which is an off-based program for little children. They sing and dance and, and play recorder and pitch instru um, percussion instruments and have an absolute blast. The most important ingredient in the success, actually there's two most important ingredients. The most important ingredient though are the teachers. Without the teachers engaging the children, um, without the, the second word is joy, engaging the children through a joyful activity, none of these extra vital life skills such as respect and compassion and, and all those incredible life skills you learn through playing music together, none of them will happen without that engagement and that joy and participation. Uh, so the key is the teacher and the pedagogy behind the, the, the joy, the love and the caring of the teacher. Thank you. Elsie Stimmel has set a model in the world for people to open up, to grow, become better human beings. It brought so much more than just the playing. It brought an awareness of who we are. All these kids are feeling this joy and this sense of pride and engagement and they don't know where it's coming from. This is a project of social and integration comunitaria, for excellence.